So guys, um, so this is a basic uh, iMac tutorial for the beginners. Um, so somebody who had just switched from desktop to iMac, uh, or you know just started using iMac or MacBook. Um, so this video is for them. Um, so let's start. So basically, what you need to do is basically this is the Apple logo here. So you just click once, and you see system preferences. So you click this and basically all the settings for your iMac or whatever you need to do change is over here um, so for example you click if you want to change the uh, wallpaper for this screen um, so you need to go to desktop and screen server double click and there is various screens here or wallpaper that you can see um, so you can choose whichever you want to put or replace or change and then it will be there so for example, so this is the text up here, so I'm just going to change this to, let's suppose this one. I'll just double click, and it just changed to another one. Um, so let's say I'm going to change this to this one, and let me change this to this one. So yeah, so basically you can change to any, um, any um, wallpaper that you want. And, and then this minus sign little here, so you click that, it goes down to the dock here and um, so just minimize button and this is just press this up if you don't want to use this again so it goes there it goes there um, and if you let's multiply this and then so you you can quit from here as well so if you don't want to use this um, system preferences uh, you can just quit from here and then just cancel and so this is app store so if you click there um, so you have the loads of app store here um, that you can download you know some of them are free up to pay some of them well most of them can be free as well you just download the app that you need um, for example you know MX old pages Carispond, iMovie is built um, inbuilt on the iMac or MacBook so you don't need to um, download that so many, many apps you can access from the app store Um, press this as well the launch pad so basically this is where everything is here where you can see everything so you can switch this like that and so these are all the apps here which you can access so this keynote is similar to the PowerPoint in um, Windows and pages is almost similar to MS Word in the Windows as well and the numbers is like actual so but I prefer using MS Office, so I've done it, uh, so I've bought this Microsoft Office package, so I've got like PowerPoint, Outlook, MS Word, let's press this off. So Finder is basically um, like Windows Explorer, and so you have everything here, so applications, so desktop, all the files you'll, be, you'll find here, documents, downloads, everything will be here, it's like Windows Explorer here. Okay, I don't have much in here at the moment because I've been using MacBook rather than iMac because um, I'm making this video on my um, iMac, so uh, it's pretty empty at the empty at the moment. Yeah, and this is the first time. It's very important first time. Um, so this mail, uh, this message so you can then yeah photos, contacts, and everything here. So let's check the YouTube video. So this is the Dolby Vision Retina display as you see at the moment. Show you the camera and um, enjoy the Dolby Atmos for uh, yeah, just cutting video at the moment. Thank you. 
this would be 238 kilometers per hour in order to steady. You all right over there? I do love Captain Mesa the bad guys. This is just a quick demo, um, so if you want to browse this um, YouTube page, you just need to click on that X um, button there on the top. I'll talk to you um, about Safari as well. Um, so the Safari is basically the similarized Internet Explorer. Um, so you click this, you can use this as a Google search as well, so you just type, um, so for example, BBC News. So just type it and it will open that. So it's basically uh, works as an internal explorer version of Windows for Mac. Um, you just type uh, so 1GBP to USD. So it works for that as well. It's basically a Google search safari. So you just type anything on this top bar here. It will load and then um, the, the site will appear. Uh, so for example, if you want to check about So, and then this is the maximize button, minimize, and then if you don't want to use this, you can just press this off as well. I'm gonna delete my bin, so to delete the bin, you just click right hand side and empty the bin. Yeah, I'm sure. And if you want to change the settings, um, if you're using the touchpad or the mouse, you can change the settings by um, again going to system preferences yeah and you see the mouse here you just double click mouse here so there are little you know how you want to use the mouse so basically the scroll direction natural so it, as you can see you just switch from top to bottom you go from top to bottom so the page will move like that and the secondary click as I said to you before right side click opens that's right click so you just can change and do whatever you like and the smart zoom you can just click once and it will just bring images closure and you just tap out so yeah, everything is there so you can change there as well and there is a dock here so if you want to like you know include minimize all the applications icon then you can click here so everything you can change the dock here all this dock means this part so you can change all these settings accordingly from this place yeah, so that's pretty. And if you, you can use this Bluetooth as well if you're sharing or connecting with other Bluetooth um, devices. Um, yeah, that's it. So I think that's pretty much um, for today. Um, so I'll, I'll post another video um, in a couple of days' time, and then I'll show you how to do more stuff on here. Thank you for watching.